Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for coming to check out Big Why Life. My name is Lauren Gaggioli. I'm the founder of Big Why Life and I'm here to share a little bit about my journey to this work and to answer questions that you might have. I firmly believe that our world is a better place when everybody can state with clarity what it is they are here to do. My career in online entrepreneurship started with an online ACT and SAT test prep company that I have now sold. And the reason I sold it is because I started doing this work and I realized that it wasn't in alignment with what I was actually feeling called to do. Ironically, it is my students that pointed me in this direction because I noticed, whether it was with my in-home tutoring company or then working with students online, that the students who could really get to work and felt motivated and called to complete their courses with gusto and achieve the greatest results were the ones who were being pulled towards a larger calling. They knew that the, the tests, ACT and SAT, were just a stepping stone along the path that they were motivated intrinsically to be on. They had this sort of internal flame that was lit. They knew what they were headed towards. They had an easier time writing their personal statements. They could state with clarity who they were. I then started to look at my friends in the entrepreneurship space and I noticed, huh, the copy that is more resonant with me is written by entrepreneurs who can clearly state in a sentence what they're here to do. But the problem with the way that most purpose statements are framed is that they are framed through the lens of a business. So when you read a business's mission statement, for an entrepreneur, it can be one and the same. Who I am as a person is my business, and that leads to entrepreneurial enmeshment. So some of the folks that had clarity were then prone to overworking and burnout and were leading lives that weren't as fulfilling as maybe they had dreamed when they had started their companies. I've noticed in my life as a parent that I am a better parent because I know how my parenting style resonates with my children. I have room to live in my purpose when I am parenting because my purpose statement is broad enough to encompass those moments that I share with my kids. So it gives me a more full view of how I move through the world and who I can be. I also know that for folks who are in a pivot with their career, my husband's a great example. He has struggled with, I've, I've done the thing, I've been so focused on crafting my career. I've been so driven towards this goal of building a career for money that now I'm going, uh-oh, I've done that, but do I like it? And he's asking that question and it's feeling a little intimidating. So he's gone through the course and he's found a new sense of purpose, a larger, more expansive way to view the role he's already in, but he did it with an eye on, maybe he would make a pivot if needed. There's a lot of different ways that this can manifest in your life, but at the end of the day, it gives you clarity of purpose. It gives you a clear sense of intention and it allows you to also have peaceful moments of rest where you can go, I checked the box, I did the thing, I made some motion in the right direction today and I can sleep easy and lay my head on the pillow tonight. It helps you clarify your communication, hone in on your message, whether that's with clients or coworkers or kids or colleges, no matter who you are, expressing yourself clearly and saying, this is what I am here to do in this life, that is so valuable and something that I think we highly underrate. This kind of work is hard to say yes to. It absolutely is. And if you know anything about the Eisenhower decision matrix, this is the important but not urgent work that gets buried. But at the end of the day, the one unrenewable resource that we have in our life is our time. When we don't have that inner flame of motivation lit, when we don't feel called to something, we instead feel pushed along, prodded along, we're trudging along and not doing the thing we're supposed to do or can't express what it is we're even moving towards, then we're in trouble. The sand in the hourglass is running out and we are not making the most of it. 
that breaks my heart. It hurts me when I see people stuck in that place. And that is why I created this course. My big why is to help others actualize their unrealized potential. So it's twofold. I help you call up what really matters to you and look at it and find a way to frame it in a, in a statement that is compelling, that makes you feel lit up from the inside out. And then we get practical, tactical on it. We start putting mechanisms in place that will help you move towards that goal in a meaningful way each and every day. This resonant statement is absolutely imperative. If you feel like time is running out and you're not sure what you're racing towards, if you feel like you can't quite get a handle on why you should be doing the next thing you are signed up to do, whether it's fill out a college application or the next assignment at work. If you are feeling unfulfilled, that's an indication that now is the time. Now is the time to partake of something like this. Here's how the course works. Over eight weeks, I guide you through a lesson and two exercises that will help you gain clarity on your purpose. We'll craft a resonant statement that will charge the needle on your life compass to true north. And then we will figure out the practical ways that you can express your purpose through your life. It might be a new career or naming a career you want if you're younger. It might be volunteer work you can be doing. It might be just reframing what you're already doing in a way that resonates and puts you more in alignment. The first three weeks are all about diving into who you are and unearthing the treasures that are already inside of you. Because I promise if you're here, you're asking the right questions. You just need somebody to guide you through the process. We then spend two weeks creating that mission statement, creating that purpose statement that resonates with your soul, not just words on a page, something that feels compelling to you and lights that internal flame that may have guttered out. And then in the last three weeks, we put practical action in place. We find ways for you to live in that purpose and express it fully. If that sounds like something you're interested in, I'd love for you to join me. It's two hours a week. It's three lessons you can do whenever it fits in your calendar. You'll be supported with video lessons you can watch anytime and email reminders to keep you on track. This kind of work is important, but it's also the kind of work that can feel a little nebulous. Like if I say, yes, what am I really getting? If you wanna feel more grounded every day, if you wanna feel like you are making a difference in one person's life or millions of people's lives or anything in between, it's important that you say yes to this. It's important that you set aside the time for this. It's two hours a week, so I have a challenge for you. Look at your phone and look at how many hours you have spent on your device in this past week. If it is more than two hours, then you have the time to do this. Nothing is more important than hearing the hollering of your own heart. So take a look at your phone, and if it's more than two hours, you've got the time to do this course. Two hours a week over the course of eight weeks, and you can have clarity that propels you forward for the rest of your life and tools that can come alongside you every time you're feeling a little bit lost in the woods and help remind you which path you should be on. If you are ready to say yes to this work, I would be so honored to guide you through it. Please click the button below. Let's get started today. I'll see you in the program.